Hello, everyone, and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy, Ivor and Spice, back at it again with another match reaction. First of all, if you're new to this channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button, and also remember to share because sharing Ivor and Spice is caring. And of course, if those who want to contribute to the channel, you can always contribute via the link description down there, via PayPal, or join me on Monday night for your live. So send your live super chat. First of all, guys, it has been a brilliant day. It's been a brilliant week, uh, a weekend. Although we had Storm Eunice coming ar around the whole entire weekend, trying to ruin our weekend, it hasn't been so. It's been brilliant. The rain came out of nowhere trying to destroy Manchester United parade, but hell no, they did it. Manchester United prevailed. And I'm glad to tell you right now, it is Leeds to Manchester United for Manchester United collecting three points in the Rose Derby, defeating Leeds. Leeds going back to their ground home, whatever they're from. And we're going to go to Manchester singing our hearts out because we are happy. Manchester United fans are happy. I'm happy. Yes, I'm so excited because it was a brilliant game of football. Even the first 45 minutes for Manchester United was brilliant. Although we started off a bit sloppy at the start, the second half as well, sloppy as what well start, towards the end we was brilliant. I'm so delighted that we got the points back, back fourth. So it's brilliant for Manchester United to get that fourth position. Although Arsenal has two games in hand ahead of us, it doesn't matter. Manchester United started off again when I said they started off slow. As usual. The usual shit with Manchester United. Started off in the first minutes. On the coach again against Leeds, sort of slow, and then eventually Manchester United started to pick up in the game. And oh my god, oh my god, guys, you would not believe it! Manchester United have finally scored a set piece, a set piece. You heard me, you heard what I just said right there, guys. Yes, I'm talking to you. We scored a set piece after 130 certain set pieces, corners. Maguire, Captain Slabbed. Yes, we haven't forgotten about you. About we need to protect you. We need to protect an 80 million pound player. Harry Maguire finally scored with that head of his, finally making himself useful. What we've actually paid for that 80 million was part of the header that they used to say Harry Maguire is brilliant in the air. Finally got a goal. Brilliant for him. I'm actually, actually pleased for him to get that goal, but still, Captain or not. We can talk about that. Bring it cross as well. I'm so delighted. It ha it's, it's just, it's, it, it brings tears to my heart, guys. It really do. Because imagine that I've scored a set. It means so much. And then the match continued. Bruno Fernandes, brilliant header, brilliant goal. Oh, Lindelof done so well to break forward and stride and glad. And I was just thinking, are you going to pass the ball, Lindelof? Are you going to pass the ball? Lindelof finally passed the ball to Jaden Sancho. Sancho with a delightful dink cross for it. Bruno Fernandes to head that goal in. Oh, sensational, sensational goal by Bruno Fernandes. Half time, it was a great half for Manchester United. We can go in after we was all ecstatic, happy. We was all thinking, please don't, don't do this again. Because we've all been there, guys. We've been there where Manchester United have gone 2 up and blown the whole situation, the whole league. They have done that. And, and they did, which, which was started in the second half. Leeds scoring, making it 2-1. Rodrigo, wow. Brilliant goal, guys. Rodrigo out of nowhere. It, was it meant to be a cross or a shot? which is debatable, but he caught David De Gea out of surprise. He did a thing. He did David De Gea dirty. De Gea looked stupid. He really did. And Rodrigo scoring leads within a matter of 24 seconds from that goal. Rafinha, who came on in the second half, scored. Scored a counter-attack goal, which, oh, by the way, came out, out from Aaron Wan-Bissaka's side because he was terrible today. He was so damn terrible. Rodrigo making it 2-2. Two -two. Us Manchester United fans getting angry, thinking, what the hell? Damn, what the fuck, man? We, we, we just can't do it. These guys got no composure. These guys are pum-pums. They're soft. They got no minerals. Nothing. Nothing in their system. Bunch of bottle jobs. Well, they slapped us in the face because we got that wrong. Manchester United came back with Fred scoring. Bruno, boom, 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 pa 
passing the ball, passing to Sancho. Sancho again collecting his second assist, passing the ball to Fred for Fred to finish it off in the top four left hand corner. Brilliant decision to bring Fred on. He came on. People were upset. We was all upset. I was upset. I was thinking, oh, we don't need Fred. We don't need Fred. But Fred proves us wrong. He said, hey, it's me, Pastor. I'm, it's Sunday today. And I must preach. I must preach the sermon on the Sunday. And he scored on Sunday, Pastor Fred. So I'm so delighted for Fred to score that goal. And then coming to the close in seconds, Manchester United probing, probing, as well defending well, making changes on the counter-attack again. Bruno getting his assist, passing the ball to Alenga for Alenga to slot it in. Manchester United scoring that fourth goal, and it was just heaven. It was heaven for us, and it was so damn good. Oh, I'm happy, guys. I know you guys are happy. But full time, Manchester United 4 2, brilliant game of football. So damn delighted. And uh, to get those points, it was needed. I did not want to draw, I did not want to lose. I had friends that said, But Oli, Oli beat Leeds. I didn't want to hear that. Now I'm telling my friends, but Ralph beat Leeds. He beat them 4-2 as well. I know we conceded two goals, but he scored the same amount of goals. But still, just one goal is different. Leeds did score one in the previous game. But today, guys, brilliant. Players today, Harry Maguire, Captain Slabed, done well today. He done well. He scored a goal. He was, he was strong in the first half. Him and Lindelof done extreme, extremely well. Lindelof as well had a good game in the first 45 minutes, especially when that, that goal that um, Bruno scored, his contribution was exceptional. The stride, everything. Ronaldo had another game where you can say he didn't have his best game. Um, he should have scored some goals as well, but he missed it. Paul Labide Pogba was explicit. Oh, you know what? Sexy. This guy is sometimes the sexy football he plays out of nowhere. It's just... Mm, Oh la la, magnifique, ah, magnifique, mon frère. Hey, la bile, la bile is too much. He's saucy, he's different gravy. He's not the ah, pistol. He's something, he's luxurious pistol, if you can get that. I, I don't know. Bruno Fernandez, exceptional. Jaden Sancho, exceptional. Both of them had a brilliant game. Sancho with the two assists, and I believe Bruno as well. Maybe two assists, I'm not sure, but you guys let me know. Man of the match today. Has to go to the guy himself, Jalen Sancho, two assists, brilliant game for him. He could have scored because, well, he should have scored to make it two assists and a goal, but he didn't do that. Don't give the match, definitely Aaron wan -Bissaka. This guy, I swear to God, every time he's on the ball, I, I laugh. It's, it's, it's a joke. The guy is, I don't know whether he's skate. He looks like he's skateboarding or not even skateboarding. I mean, I mean, break dancing. The touch... The, the, the left, right, free, lift the right. It's like he's, he, it was like he's doing spinner roonies and break downs at the same time because boy, oh boy, the passing the technique is just not good enough. And he's definitely my donkey of the match. He has to be. Well, guys, this has been your match reaction from your boy, Ivorian Spice. Big ups to you guys for tuning in and watching. Make sure you subscribe, smash that like button, and make sure you share because sharing Ivorian Spice is caring. Please also let me know who your man of the match was, your donkey of the match, and what your thoughts was on the game. It's really important. And remember, we've Manchester United Holics. We've got Atletico next game. It's brilliant that we've got these points. I'm happy about that. And it's been ecstatic. But guys, it is what it is. Remember to subscribe as well. As, as I said, follow these socials above there. Link descriptions for your football fan app to to, to join and get 20 points. Also, your clothes, your eyewear, everything down there, food, I got you all catering. Remember, as always, guys, remember to keep it united and remember to keep it red united because I'm out. Peace.